Hey everybody, welcome back. I, I hate to do this, okay? I was muted the whole time. I, I was only like two minutes into the episode, but I in the, in the interest of fairness, let me tell you, we got two wins in two rounds. It's the new weekly. I was I was selling you a, a yarn about how I, I kind of know what's going on with the daily and like sometimes you got to use the bear properly. Sometimes you got to use an aardvark. Sometimes you just lean on a dog or a hippo and then and then it's gone. My, just like that, my dream is gone for me. But you know what? We're going to try to bring it back. Now, right off the bat, I don't like um, this team. <laughs> we'll be... Um, how about a... Oh, dude, I'd love to be... Talkative mouth is great. You heard of the talking heads. How about the talking mouse? Um, I, I just don't like the team because, like, the bird... We're going to draw kind of incredibly. Bird cockroach is actually horrible because when you buff the cockroach, it doesn't even get the buff. Even the first buff, it only had it for one turn, you know? But we'll, we'll just look for levels. That's fine. Don't buff the cockroach. Oh, you buff the cockroach, you piece of crap. Okay. Um, give me some honey on a mosquito. By the way, I'm going to try to talk a little lighter because I did lose my voice earlier today on stream um, to the point where I actually ended the stream an hour earlier to rest. Then I drank like two liters of tea and took a couple hours off. And I was actually, I felt like I was sounding pretty good. So I brought it back um, with some videos here. But I do have some tea with me. I may imbibe it from time to time. Okay, how do we like this? Uh, I honestly think a hedgehog kind of goes. And you're going to say, no, it doesn't. I promise you, you just got to wait until you see um, how it works in the weekly. I mean, it works the same, obviously, but... Um, I mean, even this does nothing for us, man. Just got to think. I mean, I guess I'll just create a super soldier. And then I'll move you up to the front here. Um, and I guess we'll move the otter up as well, because we might as well. We're, we're just not in a great position here with, like, team synergy. But I actually feel like our overall team strength is not that bad. What a shot from the mosquito. Had to happen this way. And we win. Basically, so the mosquito, again, it, the mosquito didn't change, but the meta conditions of the mosquito have changed. So what does that nonsense statement mean? Well, essentially, there's a lot of low HP units just kind of hanging around. So if we know that we're building a hedgehog, I can't put you down just yet. It's just, it's just not the right play, man. If we know that we're building hedgehog, we can bet on HP and then try to use that as a as a propeller to get a little further ahead. I'm not like, okay, this is horrible news. <laughs> or wait, wait, wait. Maybe it's fine, because your blowfish is going to die, right? But I have a B. Okay, I'm the smartest person to ever play this game, clearly. We need HP. Combine me. Buy me. You still are in a weird spot, but I would I would honestly say buy, sell. But we don't want to buff a cockroach, but we got to give it a chance. Don't hit the cockroach. Don't hit. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, HP is important. Honestly, camel garlic, you got me thinking. You got me thinking on this camel garlic. I don't know how this team is going to work, but, you, you know, you can look at this and say this team is horrible. But, you know, just keep in mind, we are at what? You know, three wins in five rounds, and we just got the four wins in six rounds. It's very good. We also have no losses. Okay. Is it time? Is a, is a hedgehog king in this meta? Buy me, sell me. Don't really care what you hit, quite frankly. Sounds good to me. Take one of these. Nobody really needs a croissant. Yes. Now, bear is interesting in this weekly, but I don't think it does anything for us right now. Of course, it's like a great blowfish build. But you know what? We've done that so much. I think I'm over it. We'll get two... No, we'll get one level up next time. The bird is just... We, we got to be careful because the bird is like simultaneously not useful and also like our most important unit. <laughs> it's, it's twisted how it, that works out, but I promise you it's the truth. No, you overwrote my... Uh, freaking mosquitoes be with honey or with, with weakness, you piece. We have way too much food to make a husky work, but that's okay. Buff me. Salad might even be okay if we have to. 
I do kind of like an aardvark. I mean, we need to get something to replace this bird at some point, though. Because it's just... It doesn't fit the theme. It's basically just like a, a mosquito right now. I don't know if we can get over this hippo. I'm skeptical we can get over the hippo. Wait a minute. We were close. Okay, so they, they, that might come across as copium. We're not even on lethal yet, though. There's nothing to cry about. How about give me one of these? I, I want to take my level. I honestly <laughs> Am I really selling a 163 rather than just running like a combine? And it gives four Yes, I am. <laughs> I don't know if I would recommend it cuz it's also going to die here. Now I'll just be honest with you, that's something I didn't consider. But what if we start putting a pineapple on our other hedgehog? Then everything on our team dies before it gets to attack? Yes, but you're missing a step here. Then we spawn a bee, <laughs> which may or may not do anything at all. Hmm. This is interesting. Many people are saying this is interesting. We gotta, we gotta win this one. Look, I'm telling you, dude, it's the hardest working bee in show business right now. Next to the queen herself, of course, Beyonce. Now, give me one of those. Give me one of these. I know you're gonna die. Be a great turn for a salad, honestly. Um, you're still gonna die, even if... I mean, I guess we could give you a green pepper. You'd live through the first... Hedgehog popping. I know it seems like that's not sensible, but at least you live long enough to possibly get an attack in. I mean, we're flying by the seat of our pants here. Okay, well, you're not gonna live long enough. <laughs> but so be it. Okay, we're going to lose this one. There is no coming back from that. Now we're on lethal, but on the bright side, we have uh, nothing going for us long-term either. Level me. Little T-Rex action. If there was ever a chance, it's probably now. So we want to keep the pineapple. It will kill our T-Rex, okay? And I fully acknowledge that. We have to stay right here. Maybe. The T-Rex is like, it, it's not a get out of jail free card, but it might be like a help me get out of jail for less than I expected to pay card. <laughs> nope. No, it will not. Okay. Um, so I don't know what I'm doing on the weekly. Uh, my voice sounds good though, dude. That's a dub for me. Take a little sip of the tea. Oh, that's nice. Who would have thought if your voice uh, is, is not doing so well? Two liters of hot tea. Right down the gullet. Okay, this team, it can do something for us in the future. Let's be a friendly ghost. Anybody ever heard of a friendly ghost? I'm racking my brain. Can't think of one. Holy cow, a 2-5? You know what? That's the, uh, that's the power of an otter right there. I gotta give you respect. You, you came to play and there you go. Gnomely fans with an exclamation mark. What a, what a, what a humorous name. Now I like this. I don't mind that. You ever think so hard your your uh, thinking sounds turn into drum and bass? Did you see the tweet that went like a little viral this weekend that was like, you got to give it up to 90s dance music? It's just one amazing uh, female singer singing her heart and lungs out and then a guy with a deep voice comes on and starts rapping about the stupidest things you've ever heard in your entire life. Very true. As a Peloton user, very true. Now check this out. We immediately go dog because dog is just always good. Now forget about the cockroach. I said forget about it, okay? It's gone. I spent it. Now we focus entirely on the dog. They, they will not make a weekly that the dog does not excel in. It's just that good. How about a quick sell me? How about a quick buy me? We'll sell you next turn. Obviously, the spider does something for us as well. If you haven't been watching like the streams lately, I kind of have a vendetta against the spider right now because it inevitably spits out because because it always spits out a level, a level whatever. But then it always has two two as its stats. I find it scales like horrendously into the late game. We're gonna sell you. So I I don't take a spider anymore. I'm embarrassed I ever thought it was playable. And maybe next weekly we'll come around on that again. Salamander, I just don't think there's a lot of like, um, a lot of great salamander targets in this pack. 
I mean, you do have a faint trigger. It's almost like, I feel like it's like worth a, a purchase just to do it. And then even just give you some honey so we get another payout here. I mean, we're basically, everything we do is centered around the idea that we want to get this dog the highest stats possible. So we're, we're, it's no days off. It's every day, bro. At least we're trying to make it every day, bro. I think we draw this. I think we win this, actually. Thank you, B. So I'm, I'm feeling still very good. Honestly, you... I kind of like what you're doing, though. I kind of think you can do this. Sell a mosquito. Sell a frilled dragon. Buy a guinea pig for the stat points. Sell a guinea pig to get your gold back. Buy an owl. I do like the idea of this. And a blowfish, sure, but just, just work with me for a second here. You know what? For now, I'll take a spider. You're interesting, but I, I just don't think you're necessary right now. No offense or whatever. Um, I think I, I guess this is what I prefer. So we're going to... I don't know, man. Because we're. it does seem like we're straddling the line between a hedgehog build and a dog build. They got a puppy build. A puppy build is very scary in its own right, by the way. Puppy is also, much much like dog, a very strong unit in this pack, I think. But I'm feeling like we lose. I'm feeling like we lose by just a little bit, but that's okay. Skill difference, luck difference, skill difference. I still think you can make this work. Now you got it. No, no, no. Spider goes first. You got to go. A giraffe is guaranteed scaling, so we embrace it. And we probably embrace it. Can I tell you something? I think then you just embrace it. So both of our giraffes are going down. <laughs> but that's in the service of a giraffe not dying later, maybe. What the heck just happened, man? Everybody, you're going to hedgehog us all, man. Whatever, I lived. Okay, I'm not even sweating it. Okay, we need the space to help our dog here. We don't need it yet, though, because, like, none of these units, I think, are that important. Now, okay, here's things get important, and they get a little scary, too. Am I really going to sell a ladybug? I got to say no to that. So I guess we don't buy a guinea pig. We're looking for more traditional buy sells. This is not even really a good one, but... This makes no sense. <laughs> what I'm doing here is nonsensical. There's not that many good buy sells in this pack so i'm kind of i i think rather than roll you should always remember that a roll is worth like half of a buy sell so we'd probably be better off that's an interesting team they got with the seagull there we'd almost certainly i said probably but almost certainly be better off just taking the guaranteed one stat point we get from the dog even though one is kind of meager so are we really would we but i i'm just being honest with you I don't feel like I can sell a hedgehog on this build. I feel like my hedgehog has done me a great service so far. And maybe that'll be something that I come to regret in time. But but for now, I'm feeling like pretty fantastic about it. Because we, what we've basically done, we've kind of built like a microbe style team. When, what I mean by that is that if you don't, if you know what's coming, it's easy to counter. If you don't know what's coming, it's pretty difficult to put yourself in a setup where, you know, you're going to be okay here. Case in point, they just dominated me and clearly I've, my argument has lost all of its merit in one fell swoop. Um, so you know what? Let's get the dog going. We're on lethal. The hedgehogs are no longer the way. We actually got blessed with a, with a very nice pivot round potential here. Like, the scorpion can come out. We're just looking maybe for some buy cells before we, before we commit. And I would just... Not getting a level 2 dog does put us in a tricky spot. But we just literally, like, almost any buy cell. <laughs> just, just a level 2 dog would really hit the spot. I'm just throwing that out there as a hypothetical. This team is... It doesn't look great for round 9, but I think it looks good enough to have more than a 50% chance to live. Get soul red. What happened to my team? I could have sworn I had a dog at some point. Okay, we lived, um, but just barely. Respectability achieved, but let's take it a step further. How are we going to do this? I mean, a 1-1 stat point from a giraffe is not that valuable. 
Instead, let's get one for it and spend all our gold. Um, sell me? Buy me? Why, why wouldn't you just buy a pair in this situation? Great question. Sell me? And straight up, sell me. I know how this sounds. Well, if we're not buying food, there's really no reason to have a ladybug. This might cost us on this round, but I think it's the only way we stand a chance to win, like, moving forward. And I think we'll probably lose. <laughs> this team is a lot worse than it used to be. It's one of those things, right? It's tricky. Because I, th I think it's too late for a pivot, but what else could we do? Holy cow, we won. It does suck that green pepper doesn't protect from the peanut, but... Alas, it doesn't suck that much for me. Okay, hold on. You get added. You could... Uh, it, it, I think you just need the support. And then roll me. Good animal. Good animal. Good animal. A stork could possibly do something for you. Maybe not a lot. We're going to be on the seat of our pants for the rest of the game here. So just prepare yourself. Like, it's, it's not going to be easy. My mosquito died, which is the worst possible outcome. But then it spat out. An okay, we still lost. And when I said my mosquito, I meant my scorpion. I, we were going to lose that either way. But getting a scorpion out of a stork is insane. Okay, run it back. I actually like this. I think you create a 2-3 cricket. It's not perfect, but nothing is in this life. And we'll... we'll Throw a cockroach out there as well. Early game, I want HP, and we've got some HP. Let's be a silly shirt. Okay, insert Dan Flash's quote here. I'm going to live. I'm going to live, and I'm going to win. Can you believe this? Scaling is at such a premium, we want to see otters. I was just going to say more otters. That's beautiful. But we don't want to buff a cockroach. That's the tricky part. So let's try to spread the love around a little. I'll accept this. One in four chance to hit the cockroach. Please, please, please. Uh, you knew it was going to happen, too. <laughs> it's the worst part. <laughs> it was just guaranteed, man. We did it. We did everything right. I tried nothing, and I'm all out of ideas, man. We, we, we probably uh, we win this. I was going to say we probably lose this regardless, but look at that. We won handily. Okay, now... At least you get to keep the one HP. Level me? No levels. It's not... Eh, I don't really eh, like anything on the team here. Um, how about roll me? I'm going to say sell me. Buy me. I'm going to say puppy me. And all we're going to say with the puppy is going to be a 1-1 one, one for now. I'm not willing to sell two units to get you 2-2. Two, two. But... We're going to definitely focus... Scaling is, is at a premium in this pack. I think the puppy can pop. You just have to make sure you're always preserving two gold. We won. I'm uninspired by my team, but... but I mean, look at this. Something is happening, man. Okay, so the puppy's got to scale. Don't hit the cockroach, please. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> It's not that big of a deal. You get out here. And we can buy one more thing. There's no point in raising your attack. You need... I Look, just take the scaling, okay? I don't like you being on 3 HP. But at least it is like you have more stat points net as a result of the purchase. Now, was it sensible? I don't know. That's not for me to say. Also, the puppy should definitely be right behind the the camel. We got a little lucky there. Now, I think it's a little late for a dog, but I I respect it for sure. Um, you know, what? if the camel's going to stick, why don't you take a croissant? HP's hard to come by. Just take a croissant. Stats are hard to come by. Our cricket's not doing anything for us lately. That's fine by me. We have to purchase a unit here. 
You can absolutely, and you, the haters will say it's fake. You can absolutely purchase one hedgehog and just have it exist. Because remember, we got to keep scaling the puppy. That's why we keep two gold on hand. We are on a flawless kind of trajectory right now. Now, every time I buy a camel, or every time I buy a hedgehog, we go up against a camel. It's just science. It happens every time. We will be punished, of course. This is why we can't have nice things, but that's okay. It wasn't the hedgehog that cost us. Now... Just try it. Hedgehog weakness is more likely than you think. I would... Honestly, you're gone. I like what you were doing, but a giraffe that helps scale our puppy is worth more than being like forced to buy a cookie or something. Stay here. Garlic on the puppy can also pop. I'm, I'm genuinely not worried about this team. I think this team, it can, it can do something. It can do a lot, I hope. Can we overwrite what you got going on here? What the heck? My camel's dead. We've overridden equipment that is on the back instead of the front. That was masterfully done. Brilliantly executed. How about one of these? How about one of these? I mean, I'm, I'm ready for you next turn. And we stay here. So, I'm, I'm looking a little scared. <laughs> I think this team is better than it looks, though. Early on, I thought it was worse than it looked. They got a blowfish, but we're gonna overwrite the pineapple on the blowfish. We're gonna overwrite it. It should be overridden. I don't know what's happening, but we drew at the very least. And a draw with scaling is like a win. There's a throwback for you. How about a moose that buffs a camel? Because I think that this hedgehog is not gonna do it for us anymore. I think we do this. And we settle for a 3-3 buff on a camel. Or, or would you rather have a 3-3 buff on a puppy? You'd probably rather have a 3-3 buff on a puppy, even though it screws up our order a little bit. Put all of your focus into the one unit that can do the most with it. More puppies would be nice, too. We, we, we seem to get... There's like a one canine per round maximum or something. I don't see how we're getting through uh, the, the frilled dragon here. I don't think it can be done. Bro, we were so close. Come on. Come on. We're right there. Just roll me. It's an embarrassing shot. Freeze me. Sell me. Buy me. Freeze me. Freeze me. Roll me. We got a five and a three. Is this okay? I, we would, so that means we would take a three, three buff on two different units. Nobody needs a pineapple. Just take a cookie. <laughs> I don't know about this, man. This is... <laughs> it doesn't seem like an optimal setup. Can we can, uh, be honest about this? This doesn't seem right. And yet here we are. We're done. We're already... Dude, I'm, I'm bad. What happened? I'm horrible? I'm horrendous? This, on the other hand, hold the front door. This is like a dream team. This is a dream team. Now we can play this. Be an overpriced nut. Suspicious nut happens too. You ever be eating like a, a, a container of peanuts and then you taste something and you're like, I'm not sure that was a peanut. I think that might have been like a fingernail. It, it's been known to happen. Many people are saying it. How about one of these? You know what? Two of these, just because I, I want to maximize our ability to get levels. We may draw or lose round two, but we're looking pretty good from that point onwards. I have not seen a high concentration of fish in this new pack or this this new weekly. It seems to, to no longer have like the, the auto pick power that it used to. Okay, definitely level. I still, you can laugh all you want, okay? I still think it's worth the take. I think you can sell this. I think you can run an owl. I think you could freeze a duck. Maybe we get the chance for a buffalo to work later. And now, would you look at this? All of a sudden, we have a, a puppy that started scaling earlier, which may have actually made a big difference. This seems um, winnable. I'm insane. There's some winnability associated. Now, more puppies, by the way, would also be kind of sick. 
<laughs> if you could find it in your heart, I can purchase nothing. More puppies. Okay, with no levels, um, I would like to purchase some foods in our next shop. I know we're four squatted. I made my bed and now I'm choosing to lie in it. We're gonna lose, but only to a zombie cricket. That it's painful. You know, if we'd bought another unit, we probably would have been set there. But don't don't even cry about it. What you do instead of crying, buy a salad bowl. Buy a salad bowl, and I, I guess we're just gonna run four squatted the whole time. Another puppy. Is it possible? Could this come to pass? I'm even, I'm skipping the giraffe, and, and I'll tell you, it's things unbeknownst, for reasons unbeknownst. I don't think I'm ever going to sell my owl. I think it's become too good to fail. That's four, and I'm, even though we're four squatted, I'm feeling good. You need this. You also need this. Keep the salad frozen. Not interested. I... I'm as stunned as anybody else that I'm just continually not purchasing another animal. But I, I think we keep finding better things in the shop. And honestly, it appears to be working for me so far. I think we've, we've had a pretty good track record here. I'm not crying about it, okay? All right, so you've taken my garlic away from me. It's a little bit uh, sus. And yet, on the other hand, you're so actually lucky that you got a draw here because of your superior team craftsmanship. Mr. General Manager Joe Sackett, congratulations. Okay. Again, you're going to say it sounds crazy. How about one of these? How about one of these? And then we, we don't have the gold necessary to purchase another unit. I don't really want another one of you. I don't really want another one of you. Next round, I think we're finally not four squatted. Next round, the ladybug gets purchased one way or the other. Probably. <laughs> Hold on. I am living for it, four squad. Maybe we just run four squad the whole time so we have like a, a good reason to watch the video. Desync error, because I'm too good. Okay, let's not be a fool. Add a skunk. Freeze it here. The team's still good. The puppy's popping. We don't have to buy a pair this time. The skunk will provide much more utility than a pair. Now we're looking much better. Now we're back on the... We're cresting over the power curve. We just got to find a way to keep it that way. Sure. We have to play a T-Rex. It synergizes so well with the puppy. Put your T-Rex out there. Buff your puppy. Freeze a skunk. And then all of a sudden, this is the kind of team you can be a little ride or die with. You know, if I was at a wine tasting, I would be saying... Getting some notes of uh, maybe the best to ever do it. Look at this. It's crazy how T-Rex is like a better poodle when dogs evolve from dinosaurs. I don't really need it, but like, I mean, I guess it's always fun to get to a level three. And you know what? You're, you're kind of chilling. Why don't you just take one of these instead? Unit, you want like your second best unit to have green pepper, I think. Or your second best unit or something that you really don't want to be sniped. This seems great. It seems less good, but still good enough. Still good enough, okay. Dude, what is that? That's eight? This could work. I don't think we invest in you. I think we definitely keep investing in you. And we want to stop here. For round 11, I mean, compare this to like the, the dog that we had. At, or maybe it was even the puppy last time at, at round 11. Like it was accomplishing literally nothing. <laughs> this team is, is 10 times better and is well on its way to some perceived greatness. No, not interested. Take some foods. Honestly, at this point, you can take a green pepper. Then we'll have one roll, and I think we just chill it right here. Puppy's still going. This is a very nice, it's a balanced team. It's not to say we can't lose, but I'm just, I think I'm feeling pretty good. 
I think I'm feeling great. I think I'm feeling amazing. <laughs> I told you I still got it. All you do is ignore all of the new animals and just, you know, basically just play pack two or pack one, I guess, technically. But hey, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, if you did, click the like button. It's a great deal. Of course, subscribe if you want to see more in the future. For now, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. See ya.